Hey guys, and welcome to Provax. Don't forget to subscribe for more weekly videos and check out the Facebook page. Welcome to part three of the mini series where we will be going over the different classes of vaccines. If you missed parts one or two, why don't you go ahead and click on this link right up here. Go on, I'll wait for you. There's no rush. Okay, cool. So the rest of you guys can keep watching for part three. So toxoid vaccines. This class of vaccines is perhaps the simplest to understand and is also the simplest for scientists to develop. See, let me give you a little bit of background. So as mentioned in my first video in this series, some bacteria cause damage by producing toxins or poisons that damage your cells. The bacteria itself is relatively harmless. It's mostly the toxin that causes the damage. So what this vaccine does is create immunity to the toxin rather than the bacteria itself. So you might be wondering, why create the immunity against the toxin instead of the bacteria? Well, that's a really good question and I've got a pretty good answer for you. You see, toxins are many magnitudes smaller than the actual bacteria. Typically, it's just a simple protein. So it's much easier for an antibody to bind and neutralize the toxin rather than the much larger bacteria. Also, producing a toxoid vaccine is relatively easy. You simply inactivate the toxin by heating it or chemically damaging it in something like formaldehyde and then filtering it out to just get the toxin. So that way you can't cause harm. Then it's purified and the now damaged toxin, which is now called a toxoid, is injected into the patient, and that's how an immune response is made against the toxin. The only real downside to this vaccine class is that immunity usually isn't lifelong. This is why people usually need to get a tetanus booster once every 10 years or so, depending on the vaccine. I hope you guys liked this video. Like this video if you liked it. Leave a comment down below for any ideas for future videos or anything else really. I'll try and answer those as I see them. Don't forget to subscribe and hit that little bell icon to be notified when I upload part four. Thank you.